I grew up in a Christian household. My mom um, is a really strong believer. Um, so I, I knew Bible verses growing up. I went to church, um, tried to stay awake, couldn't. It was so boring to me. Um, but I knew who Jesus was, but I hadn't given my life to him. I sort of lived my faith through my mother's faith, but I didn't realize that till later. Uh, my first year of college, um, my senior year of high school, let's go back to that, I tore my, my throwing shoulder three-fourths of the way around labrum tear, couldn't play my senior year of basketball. That was one of my favorite sports, and I was excited for my senior year. Had to sit out and recover from shoulder surgery. Ended up decommitting from a school, going to another school. And when I reported as a freshman, I was in summer training, summer workouts, and my arm was about 40%. And you report to a college football team that's a good football team and you're, you're throwing shoulders 40% and you're trying to throw and it's not fun. Well, the first month of school, both my grandmothers passed away. Um, a lot of different things were going on. And I remember I was sitting in my, my truck and I just started crying and I just started praying. And I was like, God, I, I don't have any strength. I don't have any confidence. I have no guidance. I have no clue why I'm in Michigan right now. I'm a Texas boy. I don't know why I'm here, but I know I'm here for a purpose. And I really am gonna, I trust you. I trust you with all my heart. I, I'm giving you everything I have. I believe in your son. I believe in Jesus Christ. And I pray that you do your will with me. Um, and really at that moment, I look at that moment in my life and that's when I gave my life to Christ. And that's when, you know, everyone thinks like you become a Christian, everything's good. Hey, there was a ton of struggles from then on out, but I always had Christ. I always had the gospel. I always had my brothers and sisters in Christ to lean on and teach me. And wherever I went, God had God always placed someone there for me to help me grow in the Bible knowledge, to help me grow as a man, to help me grow as an accountability partner. And I look back and I'm so grateful for that because now I'm 28 years old and I get to be that person for someone, to be for a rookie coming into the locker room. Uh, for my wife, I'm married and I, I'm leading my household and my wife is also a believer. We just had our first child, a daughter, um, Lily, five weeks ago, and um, I get to lead her and she gets to make that decision someday. And I just look back to that moment I gave my life to Christ and everything changed for me.